In the past decades, patients have received biomaterials that have helped them repair or regenerate damaged organs. However, the risk of infection is one of the main drawbacks to their use, leading to increased complications, rising healthcare costs, and emotional burdens for patients. For instance, the five-year mortality rate associated with infection from joint replacement now surpasses that of breast cancer. Antibiotics are commonly used as a standard treatment, but this has led to bacterial resistance, which is a global problem now. In addition, long-term antibacterial activity around the implant can cause unwanted immune responses or even local toxicity. My name is Saber Amin Yavari. I'm an associate professor at Utrecht University Medical Center. I'm working on new strategies to improve implant functionality. In particular, I want to improve implant longevity by adding antibacterial properties and enhancing bone implant integration. To achieve this, I use various techniques from regenerative medicine, such as surface engineering, controlled drug delivery, and additive manufacturing. With this integrated translational approach, I seek innovation that is focused on solving both patients' and doctors' problems. Making such a knowledge accessible to the economy and society has been my passion for years. I founded a startup last year called Premier to facilitate the transfer of this knowledge from my research lab to the clinic. The first innovation of Premier is an antibacterial coating for orthopedic implants. I think substantial advances in regenerative medicine can only be made by bridging disciplines and fostering collaborations between engineers, clinicians, and biologists. The Regenerative Medicine Center Utrecht is an amazing place to work with many bright-minded clinicians and researchers that will enable me to work on novel solutions to multifaceted problems in regenerative medicine and tissue engineering. As principal investigator, I will continue to contribute and benefit from this unique atmosphere and pursue new and innovative ways to bring regenerative medicine research into clinical practice.